welcome to the What Works session. Ten interesting people trying to make things work better in cities, which is a very, very difficult task. What works for you? This apparently trivial question. The purpose of my talk today is to uh, consider how can our housing stock respond to these dual pressures, social and environmental. How do we want to live and work? How many of you are taking the car to work every day? Commuting by car. And how many are commuting by public transport? The trouble is that every day when I go to work, I still actually experience this. So if you can find me on that picture, please tell me. My hometown is Rio de Janeiro. And Rio is a great example of a city that is undergoing massive urban transformation. So, Noreen, is there anything we can do? Yes, I think so. It's pretty clear that the access for the health system was improved when the technology and the team go, goes to, to the house of the patients. What I want to talk about today uh, in detail is uh, more related to uh, the deep analysis of the large quantities of data. But what happens if you have a concert of Lady Gaga? Or you know, if you have a snowstorm, or worse, if you have a snowstorm and a concert of Lady Gaga? Fortunately, there are some solutions. So this is what we call algorithmic urbanism. Mitten is a co-working space for those who know. It's a um, collaborative uh, workspace, a shared workspace for independent workers. But most of all, to join a community of skills and very diverse skills and talents. The objective of this project is to ensure safety and transparency in paratransit system, to ensure social and financial inclusion of auto rickshaw drivers and the family, to make auto traveling pleasant and passenger friendly transport system. It's not only a possibility, but it's almost a requirement for us to rethink how we've done things in the past. Uh, street line and our work is focused on one piece of it, which is parking. So what have we learned from this project? In short, that connected commuting works, and it's already happening today.